van full of $100,000 worth of stolen equipment from a South Bay band, and it was caught on camera. The whole theft. The band leader says that he was actually able to track the thieves using an air tag. He even shot this video as the thieves were unloading the stolen gear. But then he called police and Oakland police took too long, he says, to respond, putting him in a dangerous situation. Here's NBC Bay Area's Marion Favreau. The good news, the band leader was able to get his van and his trailer back. The bad news, his trailer was empty. For years, Banda Nuevo Estillo has performed at weddings, quinceaneras, and other events in the Bay Area. But now leader Jairo Torres and his wife Elizabeth are wondering what's next after their van and trailer filled with musical equipment for the 15-person band was stolen Monday. It was parked near their home off Branham Avenue in San Jose. Over $100,000 invested my husband's hard work, like years of work, of sacrifices. That's how you know, we have family, that's how we pay our rent, our food, everything. So it's been, it's sad. In Spanish, Jairo told us he used an air tag on the trailer to track it to Oakland. So he drove to the location and this is what he found. Someone loading his equipment into a blue truck. He says he shot this video and called 911, but says no one ever answered. So he started following the truck and several other vehicles that took off. His wife says that's when things turned dangerous. By the time they knew that he was following them, they tried to hit his car. And one of them like made like a U-turn and came like on the front trying to hit him. So he just stepped on the side because he saw that they were armed. Jairo says the men in the vehicles were wearing masks and held up guns. He then went to the Oakland Police Department. But when his air tag showed a new location, he went to that spot and found his van and an empty trailer. He also found some of the metal posts he uses to build his set strewn in the street. He loaded them up into his trailer and returned home. Jairo says his group has three gigs this weekend and he's had to buy some new equipment and borrow the rest to make sure his band can still perform. Jairo says his equipment was not insured. We reached out to Oakland PD to ask why Hyro's 911 calls went unanswered, but we have not yet received a response. Hyro says he did file a report with the San Jose Police Department and plans to do the same with the Oakland PD. In San Jose, Marianne Favreau, NBC Bay Area News.